What's going on everybody? Brian here from Brian's Broadcast. I hope all of you are doing fantastic. First, I was wondering should I get this fragrance or not. Next, I'm thinking, how the do you pronounce the name? So I believe it's pronounced Soli de Tali. Soli de Tai. Whatever, man. You get it, what I'm talking about, right? This is Soli de Tali from Mansara. I've been really dying to get this fragrance, but I was torn for whatever reason. Finally got it. Let's go ahead and check it out. If you're a first time visitor on my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button if you like contents like these. So of course, I hear mixed reviews about this one. Some people say it's very nice, citrusy, juicy. Some people say it's too feminine. Let's find out. So of course, your classic Mansura box, nothing to see. And of course, the pouch is golden. All right, let's see what it's all about. So before we begin smelling this thing, quickly show you the bottle. Here's what it is. It's a, it's got some yellow fluid. The juice is yellow. Beautiful stuff. Looks already summery, and yeah, looks nice. Let's go ahead check out the notes from the website. So on the top, you've got citrus fruits. They don't say specifically what. Pink pepper and cardamom. Nice, like burst of freshness, fruity, and very chilled, like cooling sensation. That's what I'm guessing. So on, and on the mids, you've got aquatic notes, rose, leaves of patchouli. So the more dominant and a bit lighter thing in the mids, and on the base, you've got vetiver, cedarwood, gray amber, and white musk. There's a lot going on. Pretty straightforward, but I believe this one, the name, I mean, the notes themselves, they speak for themselves. So it's more gonna, it's gonna be more like on the citrusy, juicy side. That's my guess. Let's check it out. Mansera Soli d'Itali. Please forgive me if I butchered the name. Okay, magnetic cap right there and let's go ahead spray it let's find out what it's all about <sighs> beautiful fruits it's not one of your again when when they say citrus fruits they don't specifically say which ones bergamot lemon orange blood orange but it's very nice, it smells juicy. Of course, I'm gonna do it on skin because the last time I did black, black gold on skin, it smelled very different as opposed to the paper strip thing. I think I might need to get a backup bottle of this. Fresh, uplifting, beautifully done. Guys, I just need to get on skin. Yep, it's all clean, let's go ahead. Wow, 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 wow. Beautiful. Smells like summer, like right away. Just heavenly, very juicy. The citrus is very pronounced. I, again, this fragrance is not too loud. That's the best part. Like Mancera's could be, can be sometimes very dominant. Like they're super loud and uber potent. This one smells milder, like on the milder side. I wouldn't say it's too loud on the projection because I'm not feeling it right away, but it's a very pleasant experience. There's a kind of sweetness to it, like a juicy fruit, fruity sweetness to it. There's some kind of a tad bit like a sour vibe, not too much, but just the ripe kind of fruit that you're talking about. Let's say you've got some oranges. If you bite on the orange, you do, besides the sweeter taste, you do get some of that citrus sourness, like a tiny tad bit. And you've got some aquatic notes, which is not too pronounced, but you do feel that there's kind of like a watery, fresh, clean, watery kind of vibe. It's not salty though. Very clean. Is it groundbreaking? I wouldn't say this is a groundbreaking fragrance, but this is something very, very enjoyable, soothing. Like it just immediately calmed down my senses. Beautiful stuff. Something you might want to rock on a Monday to clear out your Monday blues. 
So the patchouli over here, I don't feel like there's a dark kind of thing going on. It's clean. I guess the patchouli over here is working as like a, what do you call, like a supporting note, more on the supporting note to ground the thing, like grounding the whole effect. Some woody notes, like creamy woods, like I'm feeling like creamy woods coming through. So I, I believe it's coming from the white musk that's on the base. So the white musk is probably the creamy type over here. Perfectly unisex. So those of you who told me like it leans a bit too feminine, to my nose, at least on my skin, it's feeling perfectly in balance. Not too feminine, it's perfectly in balance. Definitely doable in high heat and humid conditions, especially right now in New York City, it's very hot. It's sweltering hot, it's extremely humid, and traveling on the train and bus is a nightmare. That's exactly when you might want to pull something like this. Really loved it. Again, another successful blind buy from Mansara. This is Soli Delitali. Hope I pronounced it correctly. Let me know in the comments what are your thoughts about this particular fragrance, or is there any other Mansara fresher, citrusy side? Manceras that I might like. Do recommend me. I'll check them out whenever I can. And you guys rock. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button. And until the next one, please take care, stay safe, and all the best.